Welcome to the special episode of Rolling On TV from the RV Hall of Fame Museum and Northern Indiana Event Center located in the RV capital of the world, Elkhart, Indiana. It's the 2016 RV Business RV of the Year Award Show, sponsored by DICOR, at the core of everything you do. Cummins Onan, our energy working for you. Eric Zell, reinventing comfort and Thetford going places. Closed and Spanish captioning where available is sponsored by Jayco. At Jayco, we've been making family dreams come true since 1968. Now, let's join our host for this year's award show, Jeff Johnston and Allison Hayes. Hello, I'm Jeff Johnston. And I'm Allison Hayes. Today, we're bringing you the first ever television coverage of the RV business RV of the Year Awards. For decades, RV business has been considered the news voice, or as some would say, the Bible of the North American RV industry. Throughout its RV business magazine and its daily online industry news, the staff of this Indiana-based trade journal, located in the RV building center of Elkhart near the Michigan state line, has kept the RV industry abreast of everything happening in this dynamic business. Now, RV Business began its RV of the Year Awards six years ago, but strictly as an industry-based program that few RVers knew about. Rolling on TV this year has partnered with RVB to bring this prestigious industry award to television so that savvy RV enthusiasts around the country can see for themselves which RVs were selected as the top dogs, so to speak, for the 2016 model year. Now let's review the finalists for 2016. Our first finalist is Leisure Travel Vans Unity U24FX Flex Class C, a so-called B-plus motorhome from the Triple E Recreational Vehicles Division mounted on a Mercedes Sprinted cutaway chassis. As part of its unique space-saving Leisure Lounge system, the Unity Flex, built in Winkler, Manitoba, is equipped with a queen-size Murphy bed, a rear ottoman doubling as a desktop, and a pop-up 39-inch LED TV along with a spacious lavatory and shower. With its eye-catching design, it's easy to see why the Unity is on this year's list. Now coming up, we have a few more RVs to show you that made this year's finalist roster for RV of the Year. But first, a word from our sponsors. Simply put, Thetford's AquaCam has outsold all its competitors combined because it's the strongest holding tank deodorant available. It provides the strongest odor control around the clock in all temperatures and conditions. It quickly liquefies waste and tissue and is 100% biodegradable. AquaCam, the industry standard for 50 years. For more information, visit Thetford.com. AquaCam, another great product from Thetford. Is it now the perfect time to turn your old pop-up tent trailer from looking like this to looking like this? Treat yourself and your family to a bug-free camping season with a new tent canvas from Canvas Replacements. To learn more or to order a new canvas, visit canvasreplacements.com or call 800-232-2079. The RVMH Hall of Fame is located right off Route 80 in Elkhart, Indiana, also known as the RV Capital of the World. In the RV Founders Hall, you'll find a large display of trailers, early motorhomes, photos, and memorabilia dating back as far as 1919. The museum presents a chronological and technological history of the industry from World War I to the present. We 
besides individual displays, you can take the road back in time and walk along the road into the history of the RV industry. Whether you're a die-hard RVer or just love history, this is the perfect place to visit and spend the afternoon. By the way, the kids, they'll love it too. So, the next time you're planning a trip in the area or just visiting and looking for something interesting to do, check out the RVMH Hall of Fame Museum. Also, if you're looking at planning an event in the area, check out the Northern Indiana Event Center, which is part of the RVMH Hall of Fame. And now, let's get back to Jeff Johnston and Allison Hayes at this year's RV of the Year Awards. Welcome back. As we continue our countdown to the 2016 RV of the Year, our next finalist is the Forest River Vengeance 40D12 Toy Hauler. Forest River Incorporated's Vengeance fifth wheel, specifically the division's 43-foot 40D12 model, is equipped with a large 12-foot wide side patio that provides access through a glass door to the kitchen and through a separate door to a rear half bath. Also nearby is an entertainment system, fireplace, and TV. The garage area features a drop-down bed and overstuffed sofas. Up front, you'll find the bedroom with its king-size bed and plenty of storage. And the well-appointed kitchen is across from the spacious living area with theater-style seating. Wow, Jeff, that is a beauty. It makes an impression. Now we go from towable back to a motorhome. Our next finalist, the Gemini and Compass sister RUVs from Thor Motor Coach. These Class B Plus RVs are built around the all new Ford Transit chassis, a modern replacement for the Ford Econoline chassis we know so well. At 23 feet in length, both the Gemini and Compass have the feel of a much larger motorhome, but with the agility and ease of driving of, well, a traditional small van. With its European styling, this single slide out model packs a lot of comfort with a queen size bed and large leatherette jackknife sleep sofa. In the kitchen, you'll find a European two burner stovetop and a combination convection microwave oven. Also, notice the large skylight in the front cap. When you see how much you get in this size RV, it's easier to understand why they are gaining in popularity. Yes, and I can see my daughter and I enjoying an RV adventure in one of those someday. What do you think about that? Can you make that happen for we me? We can probably arrange something. All right, that sounds good. Now, coming up, we will continue our countdown to the 2016 RV of the Year right after this short break. Do you know what that sound is? That's the sound of family fun. At Jayco, we know quality time and carefree go hand in hand. That's why we build our RVs to handle every adventure. Then we back it with an industry leading two year warranty. Visit your local Jayco dealer to start your own generations of family fun. When you have a Truma AquaGo instant hot water system, you can expect to make a lot of new friends. We've had two different motorhomes and a toy hauler as our finalists so far. So I wonder which category is going to round out this year's finalist list. 
I have the answer right here. Oh, tell me, tell me. <laughs> and finishing up our list of finalists is the Grand Design Momentum 376TH. Now, that's another toy hauler, isn't it? Yes, it is. You're right. And it goes to show the growing popularity of this category. But what's really different about the Momentum 376TH from Grand Design RV Company, a mid-galley trailer, is that the rear garage is only nine feet long. It's a compact storage shed, as some have called it, that's actually positioned under an elevated rear bedroom that's capable of transporting a full-size motorcycle with shelving above the motorcycle for helmets and accessories. Up front in the living area, you have two huge trifold sofas that make into beds, so there's plenty of sleeping space in this unit. The kitchen has a center island with double sinks and a freestanding dinette. With five slide outs, the momentum has lots of space for luxury living. Well, that definitely takes care of our four finalists, but before we unveil this year's RV of the Year, we have a special award that Rollin' On TV is presenting this year. Why don't you tell us about it, Jeff? Thank you, I will. When we decided that Rollin' On TV would also be handing out a Best of the Year award, we wanted to recognize a smaller segment of the RV industry that normally doesn't garner as much media coverage as some of the major categories. And so we decided to present our first Rollin' On TV Truck Camper of the Year award. In line with that, we chose as our inaugural recipient an Ohio-based company that's still fairly new to the truck camper business, Little Guy Worldwide, for its Cirrus 800 truck camper. And when you take a closer look, you'll see why this European-looking unit won this year's award. Once you get past the eye-catching exterior graphics and color, you'll find something new around every corner. From the radius doors and windows to the seamless aluminum roof and opening front window. The Euro design also extends to the interior with its rounded cabinets and vivid colors. This non-slide camper was designed for small bed trucks, but you'd never know it by looking at it. It's roomy, well thought out, and built with little guy quality. Well, Jeff, that brings us to this year's RV Business RV of the Year winner. Yes, but first we have to take a short break. Oh, no, I can't wait. Well, we'll make it quick. All right. In order to give you a good look at each one of this year's finalists, including the 2016 RV of the Year, Jeff Johnston will be taking each unit out for a few days of real life use to go along with his entertaining, in-depth overview and analysis. There's also a very nice, almost full-size cab over bunk. There was only two of us on this trip. This is the vehicle that we would be comfortable driving a long distance in. Each RV will be featured on separate episodes of Rolling On TV over the next few months. Be sure to watch for these upcoming features starting later in March. At Jayco, we're a lot more than just an RV manufacturer. We're all about family. And we've been making family dreams come true since 1968. To see our complete product line and find your nearest Jayco dealer, visit us online at Jayco.com or just log on to RollingOnTV.com. Never run out of propane again. With Level Check, there's no more guesswork. Just run the gauge over the tank, and when the light turns from red to green, you'll know exactly how much propane you have left. It's that simple. Level Check, another great product from Truma. For more information, visit levelcheck.com. Welcome back. Now, I understand that the process of selecting the 2016 RV of the Year started back at the Pennsylvania RV and Camping Association's Hershey Show, a huge exposition held each September at the Giant Center in Hershey, Pennsylvania, that draws more than 50,000 attendees. That's right. And it continued through this fall's Elkhart RV Open House, right to the RVIA Industry Trade Show in Louisville this past December. 
So selecting all the finalists and ultimately the winner is a big job for the staff of RV Business. But who better to make these selections but the pros who see the products and write about the industry every day. And that's what makes the RV Business 2016 RV of the Year Award so, well, respected. So would you like to announce this year's winner? Yes, I would, if that's okay. Absolutely. All right, let's do it. The RV Business 2016 RV of the Year winner is Keystone RV's 40-foot Montana 3820 FK Front Kitchen 5th Wheel. The Montana is a five slide out unit that drew the RV business staff's attention, not only for the comfort and roominess that it affords, but for the authentically different floor plan involved. You see, in this case, the R&D staff at Keystone, a Thor division in Goshen, Indiana, moved the traditional mid-coach galley forward into the front cabin. They added a unique front windshield and converted the main cabin with its traditionally high ceiling into a spacious living room with theater seating and a hide-a-bed sofa in opposing slides. In the process, they designed a kitchen with a plush wraparound booth dinette, buffet cabinets in a curbside slide-out, and a unique automotive-style windshield with an electric shade inset into the front cap. Yes, with five slide outs, you have all the room you need to kick back and enjoy all the comforts and conveniences you could imagine. From the spacious bedroom to the large bathroom and comfy living room, the Montana 3820FK raises the bar when it comes to luxury fifth wheels. At this point, we'd like to invite Matt Zimmerman, the president of Keystone RV, up here to accept this award from RV business publisher Sherman Goldenberg. Congratulations. Thank you, Allison. <laughs> here with uh, uh, Matt and Jason uh, ta uh, to talk about the uh, Montana Front Kitchen, a uh, unit that uh, we took a, a great deal of interest in at, at the shows, uh, as they mentioned, uh, this year. And uh, Bruce Hampson, the editor of RV Business and his team, uh, did uh, pour through a lot of units uh, before making this selection. And uh, I just want to, uh, again, uh, congratulate Thank you, you uh, both. Uh, on that. Thank you. Yeah, thank you. Uh, first off, thank you, Sherm. Thank you, RV Business. Uh, you know, to think there were literally hundreds of RVs that uh, we were in the running with, um, you know, to, to receive this award is, is pretty special for us. Um, our, our industry is very competitive. Our industry is extremely innovative right now, and it makes things extremely challenging. And to be singled out of that pack and uh, be the recipient of this great award is pretty, uh, pretty uh, awesome for us. So thank you. Uh, Jason, uh, uh, give us, if you would, a, a quick rundown on that unit. Yeah, the Montana 3820FK is a one-of-a-kind front kitchen, fifth wheel in the market today. Um, it boasts a front windshield that we designed this fall, uh, allows you in the upper deck where we put the kitchen to be able to see through the front cap and get a great view of the campground or the scenery at, at uh, the state park. It boasts a, a lot of storage in the front kitchen. Um, it looks over the, the main level living room that has opposing slides with sofas that open to, to hide beds, uh, a theater seat, a floor to ceiling entertainment center, and in the bedroom you have opposing slides with a king bed and a wardrobe. So plenty of room and plenty of comfort for sleeping also. Um, I think it's uh, important to point out a front kitchen in itself is uh, very unusual. Uh, ordinarily it would be a, a, a bedroom. Correct. Um, and and, and uh, so it was your staff's decision to try this out. Absolutely. Once, once we designed the front windshield into the front cap uh, we knew we had to showcase that and, and there's, there's nothing better than our beautiful front booth that sits right underneath the windshield. It allows you to sit, have coffee, and again, be able to look out through the window. Uh, we also have a new innovation, uh, which is our pivot hinge bath door, which is a half in, half out door swing that allows for great traffic through the hallway and entrance into the bathroom. All right, well, uh, again, uh, 
I appreciate uh, Thank you. Uh, everything you guys do. Thank you, Chairman. We're honored. Well, that wraps up this year's award show. Congratulations to all the winners. We'd like to thank our sponsors that made this whole affair possible, including DICOR, Ericsell, Cummins Onan, and Thetford. For more information on this year's award winners, along with additional photos and video, visit our website at RollinOnTV.com. From the RVMH Hall of Fame Museum and Northern Indiana Event Center, this has been the RV Business 2016 RV of the Year Award Show. So long, and remember, safe RVing is fun RVing. Hope you enjoyed this week's show, and for more information on anything you've seen on the show, along with additional videos and stories, visit our website at RollingOnTV.com. And don't forget to visit our store, where you'll find some of the great products featured on our show. As usual, this has been another fun production. For the latest up-to-the-minute RV news, visit our media partners at RVBusiness.com. And now, we'll leave you with some behind-the-scenes clips from this year's award show. Cheers, here's to the Yeah. Congratulations. There we go. <laughs> Mm-hmm.